Biochar has been used literally for thousands of years. It lasts so long in the soil that the biochar that was put there either by ancient peoples who were using it in gardening or even by prairie fires or fires in natural fires that occurred in woodlands invigorated the soil in times past and one of the one of the things that happens today is basically we stop all those fires from happening in our forests and in our prairies and so there's been no regeneration of the the organic carbon that's that's been in those soils for many 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 years today when you go to the amazon jungle you find biochar that's been put in the soil literally two thousand years or more ago still working to make that soil more fertile and more productive the ways we discovered that these people, these huge civilizations, actually existed in the Amazon in a place where there were no rocks to pile up for them to make pyramids, was we, we looked to the soil and these people left their mark on the soil and today that's some of the, the most amazing soil on earth and it's, in, it's deserving of a tremendous level of study because what the terra preta soils, terra preta means dark soil, those terra preta soils today in some ways defy our best scientific understanding because they do things that other soils are unable to do. They are vigorous, they have large communities of microbes, and it seems that the, the, the secret to that is the placing of that biochar in the soil. And something about that biochar in the soil with years and years of time made those soils really remarkable.